Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So my girl Kim sent me this really fun thing from the dollar store. It's called a wind twister and I've been kind of dying to pour over it. So typically you hang it up and it spins like this. Obviously we're gonna be pouring over it. So I am gonna cut off this little string here because we don't need that for this video and it might just get in the way. And this is uneven. So I've been trying to kind of think of how to pour over it. For this initial try, I wanna just pour over the whole thing. But for future tries, I will probably just try pouring over half of it and see how that goes. For the first experiment though, we're just gonna pour over the whole thing. And because this is nice and rainbow and I think it's gonna be really fun, I'm kind of going rainbow colors on this. I'm not trying to do an exact rainbow but just kind of the gist of it. So I'm starting off with some white. These are all mixed media girl pouring paints, by the way. This is Golden Sun. Then we've got some Tiger Orange, some Primary Red, Electric Pink. Because I'm using so many colors, I'm just doing very little amounts of each color. Here we have Royal Purple. I'm going to throw a little bit of white in at this point too. And then I've got some Pacific Blue, which is a pretty deep blue. Then we're going to do some Turquoise. Here's a little bit of Meadow Green. And I'm going to top this off with Electric Lime. Now that should be plenty. I'm gonna put a dash more white in here. There we go. That is definitely a fun looking cup. All right, so I'm going to center this. It'll be interesting too to see the difference between the directions of these lines and how they come out. Oh, so I'm gonna kind of just sort of tree ring over this, I guess. I really have a very specific plan here. It's definitely an interesting kind of Thing to pour over. Hopefully we don't get too much mud with all these colors. All right. I'm going to let that sit for a minute and just kind of drain out. There's a little pool of paint here that's slowly moving out and then we'll lift it off and we'll do our tilting. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna just carefully lift this here. Set it off to the side. So if anything, this is going to be fun. I think we're gonna have a pretty wild design. And of course I use so many colors, but I'm pretty excited. Right, there we have it. Very wild and colorful. Because I think that that uh, tool, let's call it, did so many things, it's a little hard to tell what pattern it really created. I think pouring through just one half of it will give us a little bit of an easier, less crazy design the next time. But let's bring you guys in for our close up. All right, we've got a lot of really fun things on this canvas. So it's almost like doing 10 techniques in one. We've got a bit of a tree ring over here. We've got some really fun cells developing in the golden sun. Definitely a lot of colors on this one. Super rainbow. Uh, I did put more warm colors on purpose, so, and I put those in first. And therefore we definitely have more of the warm colors we have a, a good amount of cool colors peeking through and I'm just this piece is a lot of fun I'm pretty happy with it I'll definitely be doing more experiments with this and I really appreciate Kim for sending it to me hopefully you guys enjoyed this I'll see you all next time